hello everyone welcome to the industrial automation channel so today i will show you how to configure recipes in ti portal that is in siemens h1 so let's start first of all i would like to introduce what is recipe right i will tell you what is the concept of recipe and then we will start the program so let's take an example of paint for making of any paint we add uh, multiple additives in the paint then uh, mix it then paint uh, paint is ready for uh, paint is ready okay so for multiple paint suppose uh, paint type is one for paint one we have suppose three additives this is just for example okay these additives are in kg and uh, after adding the all additives we need to uh, mix uh, on the all additives so that's why uh, we have taken one more, one more parameter here mixer on duration okay so here total four parameters are there additive one additive two additive three and mixer on duration if you are programming for only one paint that is only for a single paint if you have only one uh, type of paint and you have the four entries on the hmi suppose this is 10 kg this is 12 kg this is 15 kg and the mixer on duration is suppose take example of 30 minute okay <coughs> okay if you have only one paint type then you can just take a four entries on hmi Okay, no need to add any recipes over in HMI. But suppose you have multiple type of paints. Suppose you have a number of paints. There are 50 paints, and for all paint, there are different, uh, different, different quantity of different additives, and on time is also mixer on time is also different, uh, different for each paint. So in that case, uh, we have the facility in HMI to take a recipes. We no need to program. Uh, we know to avoid the lengthy program we can uh, we can have the recipes in our hmi so for suppose for this pen type 2 second pen the first additive quantity is 15 second is 10 third one is 5 kg and on time duration may be 20 kg if third one is we will take it randomly any quantity okay so this is this is just for an example in this way you have different different quantities for all all paint type right so in this case we can use the recipes in our program so let's start open ti portal i have already taken hardware and all so video will not be lengthy if you don't know how to take hardware in the program how to configure the hardwares then please watch my previous videos okay i have taken one vlc cpu 1214c let's take one db i'm just giving the name as a recipe one recipe db okay Attitudes. Let's take it. Attitude one. Data type as integer. Okay. So attitude two. Attitude three. And last one is mixer on duration okay, we'll take it in time format this will be in millisecond you need to convert it uh, into the minute in DLC program I'm not going to show this I have already explained these things in last videos okay suppose we have taken these four fields now let, let's come to the inner part I have taken one screen already here. Okay, 
for the any screen modification you have the option here that is recipe in HMI you can see in HMI recipe screen uh, screen screen management then HMI tag connection HMI alarms after HMI alarms the recipe option is here just click on that this is old recipe I will just delete it okay we have the blank recipe here now we have you need to configure recipe here just give the name I will give the name as a paint recipe okay we have the four elements elements here if you are not showing this window then just click here right click properties you will have the recipe properties window here okay with the elements and data records in elements we have a total of four element just give the name additive one additive two additive three and last one is mixer on duration as a standard practice I will same give the same name to the display name <coughs> okay just link the tag we are tagging a recipe dip in program block recipe db first one second third fourth one okay okay so in recipe we have added our elements you can have multiple elements here Let's come to the screen part. All right. Open the toolbox. In the control section, you will have the recipe here. You can see that this is a recipe. Just drop from drag. Okay. Go to properties. In general, you just have to link the recipe here. No any setting need to be done. You have created recipe, one recipe. In that we have created paint recipe. Okay, we will just click on pen recipe okay okay done that is done okay save project let's start simulation <coughs> Just ignore this thing. Okay, we can start simulation. Okay. <clears throat> 
<coughs> simulation started so here you can see the name of recipe we have first recipe that is recipe 1 so it's you can see that name here this name is it is showing recipe name right this name okay and then now let's add one data record suppose let's take paint type 1 okay this is first number of recipe right pen type 1 10 12 15 so let's take here 10 sorry 10 12 this is 15 this is suppose 30 minute okay we have selected the um, pen type one first this is recipe number first recipe uh, this is recipe name okay um, we have entered the values for the first type paint and then just save it okay here you can see data record save let's take one more just click here add new data record this option is add new data record here you can see automatically 2 is there let's give the name post second paint type 2 okay for second paint type we have taken 15 10 5 let's take it 15 10 and 5 and on duration is we have taken 20 let's take it 20 okay just save this data record save let's take one more third type and type 3 what we have the values 12 8 12 let's take it 12 8 12 and on duration is suppose 45 minutes. let's save this okay now in plc part you can see we will just go online to the plc we have recipe block right see here if I select first recipe the here value will change right for first recipe we have values 10 12 15 30 but in PLC it is not reflected it right so once you have selected recipe you need to just download the recipes this this button is for download the recipes in PLC so just click this okay you can see the here values 12 I will just rearrange the window. Okay, you can see here 12, 10, 12, 15, t hash 13 second. Okay, let's suppose consider pen type 2. You can see here values got changed here, right? But there are already first recipes values are there, right? So again, you need to download this. If you press download, this value get reflected into PLC. Okay, in this way you can add multiple programs here. We have selected third one. And just download it. Download it right. If we have first one, we, 
if you want to upload the existing values uh, in recipes then you can select the upload this option is for upload okay i uploaded the value um, uh, value got saved for recipe number one you can check the uh, which recipe is in plc which recipe is already selected you can check from this upload okay if you want to rename the recipe you can rename with this option suppose this is this is the recipe number and you can modify the name suppose you want to give another name paint example okay in this way you can change the recipe name this button is for delete this particular recipe if i selected this the paint example we will just delete it okay deleted so only two recipes are there now because second one we have deleted if you if you don't want this recipe name button you can modify the settings from here just go to properties okay you can see here display selection first display selection list sorry just click on it you can see here recipe name is disabled if you want to show you can enable this if you don't you don't want the recipe name just disable this okay then you can uh, change the format of the text this entry name format from text format okay i hope you understood very well if you have doubt any doubt then just comment will uh, comment in videos okay friends and if you like these videos please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit bell icon okay thank you friends